today we're going to do a motor test out here on this beautiful lake and the motor test for today is comparing a Minn Kota 55 pound thrust this guy here I forgot my extension handle so I had to use my camera boom that's what that is back there so this Minn Kota 55 Enduro C2 I've got the battery underneath this front hatch and we're going to be running it on the lake at full speed just to see how fast we can get from one end of the lake to the other and also to give an overall estimate on the average top speed so there's very minimal wind today as you can see the water's pretty smooth but we'll be comparing this motor to the Newport Vessel 55 pound thrust that has a three blade prop the Minn Kota motor I'm using right now has a two blade weedless prop not the power prop so let's see how it goes okay so I'm going to start this range test from end of lake to end of lake off of this dock we're gonna go down to the other end of the lake and back to this dock and we're gonna time it and see how long it takes to get there overall and while we're doing that we can see it here on the GPS and then we'll see the speed over here on the left side of the screen let me pull up and track the time starting stopwatch as soon as I get full speed start now and we hit it up to full speed Ten and a half minutes to get down here, turning around and heading back up to the lake. getting close. I wanted to show that we are using this through the PWM. The speed is all the way up and we're in the forward position down below. So this motor will be start the same. here we are at 21 minutes and 
2121. So I'm going to shut the motor off. And there we go. So this is the setup with the Newport Vessels 3 blade prop trolling motor. This is a 55 pound thrust. And I've got this one now wired up to the PWM like I had on the 30 pound thrust trolling motor from Minn Kota. I'm using eight gauge wire to extend the wires. So I've got minimal loss across the wire up to the battery that is stored in the front hatch with a breaker on it. And this is on the Bonafide SS-127. So we'll push this one out and we'll test the speed on it using the same route that we just used on the Minn Kota 55 pound thrust motor. Okay, so we are getting lined up with the starting point of the other motor right here at this dock and here on the graph. And this is the Newport Vessels 55 pound trolling motor with a three blade prop. Same setup as the Minn Kota. We're running it on PWM. And here we go. Get it plugged in. And we're going to start the timer and turn the motor on. Go to full speed. Okay. PWM is set to full speed. And here we go. Coming up on the spot that we turned around last time, and we're at 8 minutes and 21 seconds. We're coming back up to the finish point, which is also our starting point. We're at about 17 minutes, 55, it's going to be about 18 minutes. Cutting off the motor, and there you have it, 18 minutes. So 
so we did it in about three minutes faster with the three blade prop. So after we drain the battery down about a third of the battery life from what I'm measuring with my little meter, I've taken the prop off the Newport Vessels motor and I put it on the Minn Kota motor and I'm seeing if we've got similar performance and it's looking like we do have similar performance so this might not be a factor of thrust this might just be prop design this is noticeably faster than the prop that was on the Minn Kota to start with, which is that weedless prop. So I'll have to do another test, maybe with this prop on the Minn Kota 55 pound thrust with a fresh battery and see if we can't get similar numbers past 4 miles an hour. But that's enough testing for me today. Now it's time to fish. There we go. Nice little bass.